probably have to ask my wife, you know, if I got a chance to see her. But no, it's great. Uh, time management is key. Um, a great part is Coach Freeman giving this opportunity. You know, we talked about it, and he obviously wanted to make sure it'd be something we felt like we could juggle. Um, so it's just having a good balance, knowing when to uh, be in there with the defense, which I'm in the majority pretty much all the time, and then uh, on special teams using the extra time that I have, getting here early in the morning, getting you know staying late. Um, just to make sure everything's good and crisp. Yeah, I mean, in, in practice, yes, I'm normally with the defense. So then, uh, you know, um, after practice is when that's when we're kind of when I'm getting more hands-on in terms of actually meeting with guys in the field for special teams correction. I just think his uh, focus. And, you know, he has a he has a real intentional demeanor, and really that that speaks to you know Coach Mickens and Coach even CO and the mindset of the room, right? You know, Don is quickly. Uh, seeing and, and always following X or always following, you know, BMO around and realizes, oh, they're always around in the offices. They're always taking notes. They're always doing little things mentally um, to, to be, you know, trying to be elite. Um, same thing even with their preparation in their body so we can stay healthy. You know, he's getting a lot of reps and so even taking care of his body and doing the things physically he needs to um, so he can really play fast, and that's what we're asking him to do. I mean, I think it's consistency. I mean, that was the thing we had for the years past, you know, uh, with Milk being here, and now um, it's, it's putting those guys in situations where they're going to have to perform, you know, uh, and, and do it over and over again in adverse situations. So we can really feel that whoever that long snapper is, you know, that goes out there on the field is ready to play and handle anything. We don't really talk about injuries there, so with, with BMO, uh, you know, so I'll just, you know, let that go into the, to the head ball coach, you know, kind of thing. Uh, but uh, it was great seeing BMO, you know, yesterday and the day around. Um, you know, to answer your question, I think I, I, what was awesome is I didn't feel like I had to sell anything. I tried and let my work speak for itself. And so uh, getting that opportunity um, to, you know, when Coach Freeman came in and said, this is what we want to do, it was, it was more of, hey, are you comfortable? Are you ready? And I said, absolutely. And to get to work with Coach Golden and Coach Mickens on the back end, you know, two gurus, um, it's just been, you know, very smooth transition. Um, so it helped. It helped being in here for a year, hearing the terminology. You know, there's a lot of carryover on special teams and defense um, that we use. So um, I think it was just, you know, a good natural fit and grateful for the opportunity.